Snakes are multi-purpose reptiles. In some situations, they might be the predators, but that doesn't mean there aren't stronger, fiercer creatures out there who can prey on them. Some animals enjoy eating snakes, while snakes play a positive role in controlling pest populations. Keeping this critical role aside, what makes snakes more interesting is that they come across some unexpected challengers like spiders, badgers and birds, but not all of these tend to be timid opponents as one would expect. In today's video, we'll share with you 15 very interesting incidents where snakes messed with the wrong opponents and had to taste defeat. Before we begin though, take a moment to give this video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button so you never have to miss out on any of our new releases. Honey Badger vs Mole Snake Mole snakes inhabit most parts of southern Africa. They have a muscular body and remain active during the daytime. It's not a venomous species but possesses pin-sharp, strong teeth with an edge on the back of each tooth which can inflict serious bites. However, honey badgers just don't feel intimidated. The honey badger attacks the mole snake who bites severely, but the badger doesn't let the mole snake escape. When the jaws of the mole snake are immobilized, the badger digs in for enjoying the delicious meal. The honey badger uses its most distinguished trait of fearlessness, along with its unique thick skin, having loose flesh that makes getting a grip on it quite a difficult task. Scientists have discovered that the honey badger might assist in designing better anti-venom for humans bitten by poisonous snakes. Prairie Dog Fights Off Snake Prairie dogs found in North America are very well organized, especially to confront a predator like a rattlesnake. They can detect the adversary from a reasonable distance and also have a defense mechanism within the community. Prairie dog that detects a predator informs others by barking out a distinct call, identifying different predators. In the presence of threatening creatures like snakes, this prairie dog finds its pups are in danger, therefore it warns the community. Meanwhile, it confronts the deadly snake, driving it away from the pups. The prairie's determination forces the rattlesnake to give up its desire. Prairie dogs have an elaborate alarm system that varies as per the threatening predator. In the case of a hawk, dogs in its flight path will dive into their holes, whereas those outside the flight path will stay still and observe. When an alarm is raised for coyotes, they rush to the burrows and stand outside the entrance. The hallmark of the defensive mechanism lies in the numbers. Snake Eating Spiders A group of researchers working in Brazil came across a unique happening a tarantula eating a snake, which was recorded on camera. The tarantula bit the serpent with its one-inch long fangs, having venom that can melt the snake's insides. Probably the tarantula was passing by the snake's den and considered it to be a cozy place for using as a home, and the snake was perhaps waiting there. The grassy, rocky hills in the vicinity of the Federal Conservation in southern Brazil are preferred locations for carrying out field research on tarantula diversity. The researchers found this almond-colored ground snake about 15 inches long becoming the meal of a hand-sized tarantula. Though tarantulas are generally known for eating smaller prey, including insects, smaller reptiles, other spiders, amphibians, birds, and even mammals. Lions take on spitting cobra. Spitting cobras are venomous snakes. These lions have become the prime target of the cobra for getting too close to it, but also because of their curiosity. Cobras enjoy a fearsome reputation. It is notorious for attacking intruders ferociously. The venom spat by the cobra usually doesn't harm the surface of an animal's skin, however it can cause permanent blindness if it hits the eyes. Some cobra species produce hissing sounds and lunging movements of their heads while spitting venom from their tongues, which can reach up to 6.6 feet. Spitting venom is a defensive measure, but venom can be injected by biting. These lions may not be harmed by the poison, but face blindness if they don't overcome their curiosity the Everglade Alligator Battle. Tropical wetlands found in the Everglades region of Florida have become a battleground between alligators and Burmese pythons, which are not a native species. The pythons were released by pet owners in the wild due to difficulties faced in managing them. The rapid increase in their population coincided with a 90% decrease in raccoons, opossums, and rabbits, a source of food for both snakes and alligators. Pythons and alligators are natural foes and they contest for the Everglades. The pythons ambush alligators, compress them until they stop breathing, and then split their own jaws apart to swallow the prey whole. You can watch a typical scenario with a python grabbing and eating an alligator, but an alligator can bite and get away while both die. However, in certain situations, the alligator might overcome and drown the python before eating it. Although both are apex predators and competitors, they still manage to survive in Florida's Everglades. 
Snake hunting secretary birds. This sub-Saharan bird is native to Africa and grows up to four feet in height. Mighty blows delivered with their strong legs and talons up to five times their body weight and strength help them in hunting successfully. Secretary birds' blows can shatter bones. Its method is distinct from other raptors. They catch their prey with talons and kill it using their beak. Researchers tested the strength of the secretary bird's kick by using a fake snake as prey packed with sensors. The contact time between the bird's feet and the snake measured just 15 milliseconds. Snakes are the staple food for secretary birds, therefore they have to strike an accurate quick blow on the snake's head to stun and kill the prey and avoid its venom, which could otherwise endanger their lives. Snakes eating themselves Snakes who eat other snakes, like king snake and rattlesnake, can confuse their own tails for other snakes. A large number of snakes depend on heat sensors to detect their victims. Some snakes also resort to coldo louvering, that's the fast tail wagging for luring prey. They can be deceived by their own tail for prey. Often the snakes happen to try to eat themselves, but it's not intentional. However, it can prove fatal as snakes may attack themselves if they're shedding and have reduced eyesight. The owner of a snake needs to be careful as it can begin to self-cannibalize. You should turn off lamps to reduce heat and spray the snake with cool water for alleviating stress, which may help the snake to save itself. Kangaroo Rat Kicks Back Rattlesnakes often wait for the right opportunity to ambush other animals and their prey needs to have immense speed and accuracy for avoiding their venomous bite at night. Successful defense of kangaroo rats depends on their unprecedented speed, acrobatic talents, and kung fu level kicks. They can also use their long tails to reorient their bodies while jumping. They fight in ninja style and can hear low frequency sounds. They kick instinctively to push away the predator and manage to flee safely. Researchers filmed activities of snakes and kangaroo rats with the help of high resolution cameras and observing it in slow motion, which allowed them to analyze the techniques used by the rodents. Rattlesnakes and kangaroo rats are nocturnal animals found in the deserts of the southwestern USA and Mexico. Black Mamba Battle Black Mamba is so venomous that its victims can die within 20 minutes. Four people playing at a South African golf course came across a black mamba, one of the deadliest as well as the fastest land snakes in the world. At the fourth hole, players found two mambas entangled in battle and not ready to accept any interruption. Reptiles are not usually territorial and snakes hardly indulge in a fight, especially outside the breeding season. They don't bite each other, rather just wrestle. Probably this duel was to assert dominance over each other. As soon as the golfers moved away, the snakes also made their way to the bush. Snake Eagles They are inhabitants of Africa and are smaller than bald eagles. Because of their love for eating snakes, they are obligatory predators for some snake species. They typically conduct hunting from tree-perching hillocks and exclusively on the ground. On spotting a snake, the eagle swoops down immediately, grabs the prey with its long talons, and flies upward. When the snake tries to get free, the eagle crushes or tears off its head and swallows it first. The legs and toes of the snake eagle are covered with thick scales which protect it from poisonous snake bites. Snake eagles can hunt lizards, rodents, bats, and fish. They reside in open woods and wooded savanna, preferably areas where gully or wooded hills break open into flat areas that make sighting snakes much easier. Old Guy Kicks Deadly Snake an Australian gentleman came across an eastern brown snake, which is one of the world's deadliest snake species. While moving on a beach sidewalk, probably in Queensland, Australia, he kicked it casually. The serpent was idly lying on the grass beside the concrete footpath. As he boots the snake, it's enraged and rose to strike back, but the man kicked it again and continued to walk. Though the defeated snake slithered away, it could have easily killed the man. The eastern brown is known for being the second most venomous snake in the world. The species has very short fangs and injects a very small quantity of venom, which is more than enough to kill a human. The Bravest Iguanas This iguana has been sighted resting on the beach of Fernandina Island in Ecuador. Meanwhile, a race of snakes appears and the iguana instinctively stays calm, hoping to remain unnoticed. Iguanas dive into the ocean looking for seaweed and sea algae. The iguana has to pass through the racing bunch of snakes to reach the water. As it starts running, the snakes commence chasing it. The iguana is caught up by a group of entangled serpents. However, it manages to free itself and moves up to the rocks. It makes a slow, desperate move when a snake tries to trap it inside its wide open mouth. Ultimately, the iguana managed to get the epic victory against the snakes. People who filmed this battle were lucky enough 
as the serpents had no interest in targeting humans, only the iguana. Insane Praying Mantis Praying mantises have been named so because of their incredibly bent front legs in a praying position. Early civilizations, including ancient Greek and Egyptians, believed that mantis possessed supernatural powers. They're famous in cartoons where artists imagine their female as a femme fatale. The majority of mantises are ambush predators who only feed upon live prey. They can easily merge with leaves and foliage and patiently wait for the insects like grasshoppers, flies and, at times, snakes. They stalk their victims stealthily and strike swiftly to grasp with two spiked raptorial forelegs which can securely hold the snakes. This predator is capable of killing prey three times its size. Using its immense striking power, the praying mantis slowly consumes the unlucky victim with its ultra-sharp mandibles. Snakes messing with the wrong chicken Usually people think that a chicken would give in once faced with a venomous serpent, but a mother hen can be exceptionally determined and can confront more than one adversary simultaneously. Snakes like to feast not only on chicken, but love chicks and unhatched eggs. Therefore, they sneak into chicken coops even through very narrow openings. In this footage, the mother hen can be seen indulging in a fierce fighting with cobras who slithered inside the enclosure. She kept blocking the path of cobras till her chicks managed to escape safely. In the second clip, another mother hen can be witnessed defending her eggs from a big rattlesnake that slipped into a chicken coop. The hen contested bravely and foiled the snake's attempt without losing even a single egg. Owners should ensure that their chicken coops are sturdy and secure so that snakes cannot creep in. The Mongoose and the Cobra Mongoose possess very strong jaws and thick skins. They're quite agile and swift, having a long body with short ears they look like weasels. Some of them prey on and eat snakes. They don't shy about confronting cobras having toxic venom. Mongoose are fearless and notorious for killing snakes from black mumbas to the deadliest king cobra. These furry animals are incredibly robust and have a great resistance to snake poison that enables them to keep struggling even after getting bitten by venomous snakes. Due to special mutations in their nervous system, the neurotoxin faces difficulty in binding their receptors, making it less effective. Mongoose make a glycoprotein that binds the protein and the venom, therefore the normal amount of snake venom would not affect them much. They have their own antidote to the cobra's deadly venom. We hope you enjoyed watching these terrifying snakes lose for once. Do share your views in the comment section. We'll be back soon with another informative and amazing video for you guys. Until then, take care and have a great time. Goodbye.